went back and looked at exactly what was being discussed on all the TV shows except yours at 7 or 9 a.m. on Wednesday when this happened. And it's a really curious exercise because as Steve Scalise was fighting for his life and crawling into right field in a trail of blood, you should go back and see what people were saying about the president and the Republicans at that very moment. Of course, they had a break in with the news of this tragedy. And since then, there's been some introspection, some quieter, more muted voices toning down the rhetoric. But look at, look at Twitter. If I were shot and killed tomorrow, half of Twitter would explode in applause and excitement. This is the world we live in now. And, and, it's, and it's, it's terrible because, it's, again, it's one thing to say, I disagree with you on health care repeal or on taxes or on your plan for national security. But you can't attack people personally in a way and, and think that tragedies like this won't happen.